Hey crossword fans! Today we're going to be solving the New York Times crossword for Tuesday, January 17th, 2023. Alright, let's get started. One across. The NCAA's Crimson Tide to fans. Okay, I've seen this on enough puzzles to know that it's Bama. Yeah. Look at this, we do have some shaded squares today. That's so odd, they're all kind of clustered over on the left side of the grid here. I guess they're all at the beginning of these across answers. Let's see if we can get this first one here. Word after rock or rubber? Rock band, rubber band. Mine in Marseille. Um, didn't we just have this on yesterday's puzzle? We need the word for mine in French. So that's going to be a moi. Parent company of Facebook. That's going to be meta. Odd exception. Hmm. Is that an anomaly? Yeah, that does fit. So we have amen, cry from a congregation, that's right. Okay, so we have dia, that's the Spanish word for day, right? What is this clue here? Couple's 60th anniversary, Spanish. Okay, well that kind of confirms our thought about this being the Spanish word for day here. And a 60th anniversary is the diamond what? How is this going to end? Hmm. I don't know. I'm going to need some help to get the end of this one. Zero zippo zilch. Um, hmm. It's not not one bit. I think it is going to start with not one. Maybe not one iota? That looks pretty good. Uh-uh. And these quotation marks mean we need to come up with an equivalent phrase. I think a good equivalent here could be nope. Collapsible camping gear. That's got to be a tent. So we have apt here. Fitting. Yeah, that seems pretty good. Scroll through a few books. And this is wordplay. That's indicated by this question mark here. What we have to do with wordplay clues is look for a punny answer. So this is not going to be scrolling through a few books on an e-reader. I think maybe this is going to be a book that is held on scrolls, like old-fashioned scrolls. That could be the Torah. That comes in scrolls sometimes. Nullify, that's got to be void. Obsolescent devices with rewind buttons. This has got to be VCRs. Bovine is to cow, as corvine is to crow. Yeah, corvine, what a word. Family friendly as films. That should be rated G. I wonder if we have the German tag here as our next foreign language word for day. Let's see, so is this diamond wedding? That would fit. Let's see, sketchy behavior. I really want this to start with shady. Or maybe it's shadiness. There we go. A panda's is almost entirely bamboo. Yeah, that's their diet. They pretty much only eat bamboo. Taken care of with with. That should be dealt with. Phrase sung 36 times in a 1970 Beatles hit. Ooh, okay, so this is one of their later songs. Hmm. I'm not sure what this is. Plow pulling pear. Maybe that's oxen. Click. Could that be a gang? A group of people? Lincoln blank toy set. Those are Lincoln logs. I used to have those as a kid. Proctored event. That's got to be an exam. Hamilton's notes. 
he's on the $10 bill, so this is going to be tens, plural, because they asked for notes, plural. So this is SMS, sort of cell phone text for short. Yeah, that's right. Oh, is it let it be? Okay, there we go. So let's go ahead and see if this is German. Oh, it's not. It's Dutch and Swedish. All oh, rats, another equivalent phrase. I guess that's going to be dag nabbit. That's a really fun entry there. Okay. Cacophony. That's a lot of loud noise. That could be a din. Actor John, Sean, or Mackenzie. Uh, is that Sean Astin? I don't know if I've heard of these other two actors. Let's see if this is right. Contraction in Deck the Halls. Yeah, tis the season to be jolly. All right, let's take a look at our next theme answer here. Whom one might go see at Tooth Hurdy <laughs> for a classic joke. Check. I've heard this joke before. This is very funny. Who do you go see at Tooth Hurdy? A dentist. That's really funny. Okay, so this is den. The Czech word for day. I don't think I've heard of that one before. Let's see if we can get our last day over here. Saunter. Could that be Amble? She ambled over. It was all blank. They were just pretending. It was all in act. Ooh, maybe we do have Tog after all. Elder Obama daughter. That's Malia Obama. Singer activist Billy. Ooh. I don't know if I know this one. Blank a soul. No one. That's gotta be nary a soul. Pie blank mode. Pie a la mode. Pie with ice cream. Singer activist Billy. Is it Billy Bragg? Cubans, for example. Yeah, that could be cigars. And this is Tog. Goes with someone else. German. Okay, so maybe that's tags along. Very nice. Okay. All for one and one for all. Hmm. Is it as a unit? That would fit. I don't know how much I like that answer. Substance in a Petri dish. Well, that could be alga. Um, or maybe it's agar. That's a growth medium. I kind of like that better is tiresomely long as a meeting. Yeah, that's gotta be drags. Electrical transformer named for its creator. That's gotta be a Tesla coil. Okay. Garand suffix. A garand is when you add ing to a verb to make it into a noun. And this is ins for professional connections. That's right votes into office that's got to be elects so we have bc secretly included in a way oh okay this is going to be bc seed you blind carbon copied someone on an email things filling an agenda that's got to be items letter shaped opening in hardware uh, I don't know if I've ever heard of this before, but it looks like it has to be a tea slot. Is this a cell? Cartoon collectible, yeah. Did you get it from the Disney morgue? <laughs> Show the merits of, say. That's got to be demo. Center. Is that the midst? You are in the midst of all the action? They get walked all over. Hmm. What is this going to be? Is it mats? Like welcome mats? I don't know how much I like that answer. But, well, I guess that could be a pal. Let's see if that's right. Widens as a pupil. Yeah, that's got to be dilates. Okay. Maybe it is mats. Long for. And when you have a word in parentheses at the end of your clue... That means that same word needs to be able to go at the end of your answer. So I think this is going to be pine for. You're really longing for something. 
prognosticator. Is that an orator? I wonder if we're going to have a revealer here. Let's take a look at this. I think we're done here. Or a hint to translating each of the four shaded words in this puzzle. Shouldn't that really be, let's call it a day? Yeah. Nice. Okay, so it wasn't as a unit. Let's call it a day. So what is this going to be instead? Maybe it's as a team. There we go. Nice. That's a really fun revealer. Let's call it a day. And we've got four days in different languages. One of more than 14,000 in Minnesota. Hmm. Uh, is it a lake? Do they have that many lakes? Wow, that's amazing. At any point. Is that ever? Command S on a Mac. That is the save command. Furniture giant whose name is an acronym. Is that Ikea? I don't think I knew that Ikea was an acronym. I wonder if it's an acronym in Swedish. Command just before giving a dog a treat. Looks like that's going to be sit. And we have term. Lifetime for the US Supreme Court. Yeah. You spend the rest of your days on the court. Okay, so what is this along across here? Rhode Island with the... Hmm... Uh, isn't that the ocean state? So it's not an orator. Hmm... Oh, I guess this is an oracle, right? A prognosticator isn't just someone who talks a lot. It's somebody who predicts the future. That makes much more sense. Okay, so this is going to be ocean state. You win, an equivalent phrase. I think that has to be, I lose, QED. Okay, kings of blank, sex on fire quartet. I don't know if I've heard of this. Is it Leon? You might give something up for this. I guess that could be Lent, right? People give things up for Lent. And this is a last, stick around a while, yeah. Kind of like someone on the Supreme Court. Facts and figures. I suppose that's going to be data. Perched on has got to be a top. And desires, that's got to be yens. That kind of feels like a partner to this pine answer over here. Okay, so this should be saps. Easy targets. Yeah, they're easy targets for cons. Excellent. All right, let's throw this S in there and see if that'll do it for us. All right, a Tuesday puzzle in a very quick 17 minutes. So our theme today was about phrases that start with the word day, but in different languages. We had diamond wedding, dag nabbit, dentist, and tags along, all starting with a three letter word for day. We had dia in Spanish, dog in Dutch and Swedish, den in Czech, and tag for German. Yeah, this was a really fun theme, and all of these theme entries were pretty great too. I really loved Dag Nabbit, and I really appreciated this dad joke of a clue for dentist, whom one might go to see at 2.30. That's a really good one. And we also got this fun revealer at the end too. On top of that, there was a bunch of really nice fill. We got a Tesla coil. We got the Beatles classic, Let It Be. There was some shadiness. There was an anomaly. We got to visit Rhode Island, the ocean state. Yeah, there's a lot to like in the fill here. And I loved the clue for Torah. Scroll through a few books. That's very clever. All right, well, I think we've said all that needs to be said, so let's call it a day. I'm going to be coming back at you tomorrow for the Wednesday puzzle, and I think that's going to do it for now. All right, I'll see you next time.